Sorrento again and we are making our way through to Capri but to get to Capri we have to get to the port so we are walking down the stairs to the port but look how high this is What? Say again? It's not high daddy, I'm not even panicking It's not high? Watch, watch up until you're gonna come down It doesn't really matter Cause you're here with me now It doesn't really matter Cause I feel so free now the tickets now to board the boat to Capri. It's quite a few people going to Capri today, so look at the queue. <laughs> and there's the ship arriving. So De Costa, what is your what is your first impression of Compre? It's nice, but I'm hungry. Nice, but you're hungry. And you little man, are you tucking in already? Do you like Capri? It's great. You sound amazing. Alright, so suppose the first thing you gotta do is find something to eat, so let's hit it. Uh, So we just made it to the top of the mountain, top of Capri, and this is uh, this is what it looks like. This is it's fantastic. Look at this. Chantal da Costa, if I had to ask you of your opinion with regards to Capri, what would you say? It's gorgeous. It's proper, eh? So this is probably one of the most beautiful places I've been to. So this and Positano are on top of my list. To show you the port from this side. So you can look out all the way out to the sea from this side. So that, that was the ship that brought us in here this morning. So we're just walking around the Capri town and everywhere you look it's just got these views. So how's this restaurant on the edge of the cliff? And that's the view they're looking at. Just unbelievable. And we were standing, we were standing just at the top of the hill over there. So you can see it from the side here. Just over there. Did you say something there, Chantal Costa? It feels like a Monaco. It feels like Monaco. So we made it back to the port where we're going to catch the boat. Hey Rebel, how, how packed is this place? It's not even peak season. So now we're going to head off to that port in the corner there to catch the boat. Place is packed. And then there's all the little cafes on the side here. All right, so next is to catch the boat back to Sorrento. When I'm with you, I am able to keep 
Pushing my limits and all the trials that I have while I'm going the distance. How did you find Capri and where are you going to right now? Capri was nice, but hot. We are going to Sorrento. And what are we going to do there now? Where are we heading tomorrow? Florence. Florence. So the Florence part of the journey starts tomorrow. So we got a three hour train ride over land. And then we hit the new part of the journey which is Florence. So looking forward to it. Okay, so we find the restaurant we're going to eat at. Have a look at this place. So this is the last supper in Sorrento. So that's Rebel's food. It's very really nice. Enjoying that Rebel. I am. It's really good. The little man decided he wants a salad, so he's having a big salad. Hey, big boy. And I'm having the gnocchi. Not too shabby. And of course, you've got to have a good view to go with it. That doesn't look nice. Nah, oh, come on. Looks good, man. Sometimes when you're here. It doesn't really matter